It was October 14th, two weeks before the Ivy NBA Olympics, and Curtis was in the lounge preparing intensely for the tournament. As Curtis was conducting his research, the weight of the tournament began to sink in. Was I nervous? Sure, I mean, who wouldn't be? Such a big tournament around the corner. But I was excited and I was gonna get locked in. Nothing was gonna throw me off my game. But something did knock Curtis off his game. An interview with one man in particular. So Jonathan, otherwise known as El Presidente, how have you prepared this year for Ivy Olympics? So this year, my team and I have been training really hard. Uh, I've been getting great contributions from every team member, and I'm talking four out of four contributions here. So I'm really excited for the tournament coming up this weekend. There's some fierce competition in the Ivy Olympics this year. You have many favorites like Curtis's team. How do you see yourself doing this time around? I think it'll end the same way it did last time, with Curtis crying in a corner and me holding up the trophy, bathing in the glory of his downfall. Outside of Curtis, it's a great team, no doubt. But as long as Curtis is playing for them, they don't have a chance. <laughs> so Ivy prides itself about being a supportive culture. Everyone has each other's back. Do you think we'll have this emotional support going into this tournament? Absolutely. And even when Curtis does lose again, I'll be there for him with a new stuffed toy raccoon and a gift card to Crescenzo's Pizzeria. Curtis, I'll take care of you. The next day, Curtis walked over to join his teammates on the practice field. He was still furious about that interview with Jonathan, but knowing his teammates would ask him about it, he decided to put on a brave face. Hey, what's up, nerds? What are you guys watching? I, think it'll end the same way I don't think you're going to like this. Oh, him. Really, really dislike that guy. Something about his face. I just want to punch. Hate him. Curtis, are you sure you can go face to face with him? Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I, I'm fine. I'm fine. Come on, let's go. Let's, let's go play. Come on. So I guess Will and I are going to throw it back and forth, and then you guys, if we do it correctly, you'll throw it back and forth. But you have to catch it. Make sure you catch it. Sure. Okay, just like that. Got it. See, Will, it's easy. Come on, one more. Oh, shit. Wow, we're so ready. I hate John. Suddenly, Curtis froze up. He was thinking about Jonathan. And then he was struck. Nyan was concerned for his friend. He knew Curtis needed help. Who were you thinking of, Curtis, when you dropped the egg? I wasn't thinking about John. That's I was, I was thinking about John. You were thinking about Jonathan, weren't you? I often am. I know how you're feeling, Curtis. You and think, you don't need to hide it. Do you think about John a lot as well? No. Okay. But I know that you think about justice. And I know that you want it. What about truth and beauty, Nyan? That's not that. That's out of the bounds of this, this okay. conversation. That's for you to find. That's personal for you. Okay, I can do that. But if you want to find justice, I was like you, and my sensei helped me. Can he help me? I think he can. Come with me. Good, because I have a lot of egg on my face. The sensei yes. was out of office, so Curtis booked an appointment for the following morning. Curtis had trouble sleeping that night. No matter how much he tried, he couldn't get Jonathan out of his Curtis. head. Curtis, you'll never be as good as me. Even once Curtis finally fell asleep, Jonathan still followed him. John? What are you, what are you doing here? Oh, hey Curtis. Did you want some water? I know you like these at practice. I did want that water. It's my last one. You don't need that. Dude, who are you talking to? I'm talking to John. How did you get in 
Oh, uh, are, are you the sensei? I'm whatever you need me to be, my child. The question is, what do you seek? I seek the means to destroy my enemies. Well, one in particular. Ah, Mr. Soriano. Indeed. If that's what you've come for, then you've already lost my child. There is no path from vengeance to victory. What, what should I seek instead? To know what you seek, you must first know what you fear. I fear letting my team down when they need me the most. I fear crumbling, cracking under the pressure. I fear when the lights are shining the brightest that I might just get blinded. I fear failing where I've failed before. Mm. So let me ask you again, Turtis. What is it that you seek? I seek the means to conquer my fears and defeat my enemy and leave him in tears. Remember, every winner was once a contender who refused to give up. Train you, I will. Let's begin, my child. Your journey is about to begin. When I first met him, I was actually not sure that Raccoon was sleeping. But Turtis persevered, put in all the effort. Now that Raccoon's popping. I've never seen Curtis this focused and determined. He just became somebody else entirely. It's incredible. I value John as a competitor. I value his team, great bunch of people. I wish them nothing but the best. But at the end of the day, I have belief in my team and myself, my sensei taught me how to behave, how to think, how to be better. And I will take my learnings from my sensei and I will defeat John Soria. Many times, so many times. That rat Yeah, I'm really proud of Curtis. I think he faced his demons, looked them in the eye, and he found his inner truth. And it's just amazing to see someone find justice for their past. Truthfully, it's beautiful. I must say, I've been somewhat impressed by what I've seen on Curtis's Snapchat. In between the raccoon snaps, he's shown a little bit of improvement. But I'm not too worried. We'll see if he actually shows up to play on game day. How do you feel, my child? At peace. You're ready. Distinguished guests and students, today is the day that you all have been waiting for. 16 teams will be vying for the coveted Ivy Olympics Cup. Remember this, the training curve. Yeah, your performance fluctuates. But if you put the effort, then you have higher success. You've all been vigorously training for this. Now, you will have to lose yourself in the moment. Because you've got one shot to win this cup. 
So who will be the number one? And who will redeem themselves? <laughs>